Mr Speaker, you can't say you're fearlessly tackling the most difficult social problems if you turn a blind eye to what goes on in our prisons and our criminal justice system. Now, my right hon. Friend, the Lord Chancellor, has worked with the Lord Chief Justice and others to put forward a typically bold and radical plan to transform our courts so they are fit for the modern age. Underused courts will be closed, and I can announce today the money saved will be used to fund a £700 million investment in new technology that will bring further and permanent long-term savings and speed up the process of justice. Old Victorian prisons in our cities that are not suitable for rehabilitating prisoners will be sold. This will also bring long-term savings and means we can spend over a billion pounds in this Parliament building nine modern new prisons. Today, the transformation gets underway with the announcement that the Justice Secretary has just made. I can tell the House that Holloway Prison, the biggest women's jail in Western Europe, will close. In the future, women prisoners will serve their sentences in more humane conditions, better designed to keep them away from crime.